What is up guys? Shino here and I'm playing some mid ADTF and I think I'm gonna get call. I think I'll get call for this one. I got my item sets here for basically all of the marksmans and plus TF. <laughs> and uh, pretty much this item is only for TF. Decided to get called. This is like TF is like the only champion that I ever get call on, and it's mainly because of the fact that since I already since TF's passive is pretty much like call anyway, it's I might as well get called to be honest. So right. get like one extra gold for each minion I kill until I get a hundred extra gold from a hundred minions, then I get a three fifty bonus gold, which I actually use for something. So like this. Call is actually not as strong as Doran's Blade, and usually when I'm playing my Marksman's, I usually get uh, Doran's Blade, and then I'll usually end up selling it for, uh, what's the item called? One of the items for Blade of the Rune King. This one, or this one, whichever one, however much money I have, which is basically like an, just an extra step up from Doran's Blade. So, with the extra money I get from here, I typically go and sell that. And then buy Vampire Acceptor. And then I'll continue on. Because it gives me a little extra gold. I mean, it costs a little extra more, but... That's alright. Give me this. Echo really wants to know who, is, who he's laning against. I don't, I don't particularly like fighting Echo that much. Kind of annoying. Especially his ult. But I got a stun, so maybe I can time my stun. Oh my gosh, I already missed one. That sucks. I swear I thought I was going to get that one. Let's go! Get, look at look at all that all that gold just pop up. What up? Oh damn! You hit me. One reason I love playing ADTF is just the fact that uh, he literally has a stun like every three to four seconds and it's freaking OP. I mean, any other champion you typically play AD with, uh, well, any marksman pretty much, uh, without having an an ultimate stun. No one has like a stun. They're all snares or slows. And I think it's just Ash who has her ultimate as a stun, but TF, TF can get a stun pretty much all the time. And not only that, but I also love the fact that I can help out my teammates more with my ult. So definitely when I'm playing TF, I'm definitely look, looking for chances to ult. And I'm almost always ulting in bushes too, so. If they're not anywhere near me, I still try to ult in the bush. That way they can't see me ulting in. I feel like that's way better than just blatantly showing them that I'm alting in and then they just start running away. Especially if, especially if like I tell my teammate I'm coming in, so they jump on them, and the enemy the enemy guy doesn't know that I'm coming in, so he just ex expects that he might get the kill because he's just fighting someone he might be able to beat. But then I'm coming in. I don't know if that makes sense. I completely butchered that up. I'm trying to see us here, <laughs> but yeah, Echo is gone, and I should have pinged that earlier. My bad, anyone who gets Echo. Where's Echo? Did he just back? Oh no! Damn it. One thing I don't like about ADTF is because I'm just so used to Varus' uh, damage very early game that TF, that the damage for TF isn't that high until I get my this the card thing. Then it comes up. He, so he actually went back. What did he get? Another potion? No, he didn't get anything. What? Did he go back or what did he do? He doesn't have blue. Weird. Oh my gosh, man. Stop missing CS. Typically level up the stun first. That way it lasts longer. I I know a lot of good TF players typically use their blue card a bunch. a bunch, Just constantly spam their blue card. But I, I tend to not because... I'm always careful. That's It's the same reason. It's a similar reason why I don't... Um, what up, dude? What up? What up? Let's go, let's go. Outplayed. But yeah, uh, it's 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 a similar reason to Varus why I don't spam my skills. It's because I want to have the skill just in case I need it for something. So for Varus, the skills are basically my main damage. And if someone comes and ganks me and I need to do damage, but I don't have the skill because I was using it to CS or something, then, you know, it's tough for me. But for... For TF, I definitely use it for ganks, especially because, um, 
someone coming and then stunning a gank. That's also what I hate. I hate it when... I hate it when I just can't kill a minion under tower, but yeah. When someone's coming in for a gank and I definitely need, I definitely do need to stun someone. That way I'm not taking so much damage. Um, I have no idea where Echo is still. Like, he's just... Oh, there he is. What up, bro? Oh, I was just out. What up? Get that. Give me some mana back. He got me there. He got me. He was just hiding in a bush. Did he do that last time? Was he just hiding in a bush last time? Is that what was, is that what was happening? Echo, you sly dog. Oh, he used a potion. Echo, you're dumb. Oh, snap. I'm dumb. I went too close. I gotta get more CS, man. This is ridic ridiculous. Get that. Give me that. I'm not gonna be able to get that anyway. Usually, usually when uh, a mage minion takes a tower hit, I can usually destroy it in one shot, but not with TF, because TF doesn't have as much damage as Varus or Jin, which sometimes I also hear. What up, bro? Oh no, I'm gonna take it! Ugh. I did not want to take that hit. I have to watch out for uh, Echo's ult now. Definitely don't want to be there when he when he has his ult, so then he can ult me. Boop. I can hit these guys because these guys are already low and not that. Oh, still got him. Um, I'm gonna pop a potion. I definitely don't want to leave lane yet. What up? I hit you. Yeah, I don't think he was trying to trying to stun me there. Woo. I was expecting that uh, that shield thing to go under tower. What up, TF? What up? What up? How am I doing on CS? How are you doing on CS? 23 CS. Wow. I'm doing great. It's especially good to be winning in CS with TF because since I also get the bonus gold. Not only that, but I also have call, so I'm also going to have even more bonus gold. Eventually, when I finally get the... Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, bot lane. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, that was my fault. I can't do anything, damn it. I was, I was looking for a chance to uh, alt in, but that was totally my fault. Echo ran away and I didn't see him, damn it. I'm so sorry, bot lane. Get a couple hits on this tower before Echo comes back, which he is definitely coming back. Although I did not see him go over this, so a little, little, little wondering where he is. All right, well they were five and zero. Oh. That's not good. We can still turn it around though, guys. I have faith. Should I just get this first? I might as well. Yeah, I might as well get that first, to be honest. Might as well. Since I'm gonna end up buying it anyway and selling this, so as soon as I get the bonus gold from this, I'll sell it right away. Because I don't need it anymore. Not as good. Three plus three life on hit, I could do I could do better with uh the I think seven percent that uh Doran's Blade does. Or three percent. Is it three percent? Yeah, three percent. 3% is way better than plus 3. 3% oh, is already 30. I already have... I'm already dealing 100, over 100 damage. So, yeah, it's definitely going to be over. What up, man? No, give me... Ah, damn. What up? You can't hit me, bro. I'm too good. Did he just- he just took a free tower hit and two auto attacks. Too bad I didn't have my passive on. Now that I have the damage, now I can hit- I uh, can kill the minions. Under tower. I reckon. Um, who's mainly winning? Bot lane. I gotta go help bot eventually. Should I do it now? Ah, oh, they're too high. I mean, I can't take them on by myself, that's for sure. I don't want to run into his ult. That's a big mistake. What up, bro? 
Damn it, it's just it's the slow, I can't do anything else. Ooh. I could have done something there. I did not expect him to use his ult. Now he has no ult, so. You know what? Let's pop a potion. Please go on me, bro. Please. Please go on me. Uh, can't run away. You can't run straight away from the thing or else it's going to hit you again because of the slow. No, I missed it. Oh, I'm so dumb. No, Echo's not here. It's probably going somewhere. I don't know where. Probably going back, to be honest. He's already used his ult, so he's got no, nothing to help him out. Need 33 more to get the bonus. Ooh, he's... Oh, that's Kindred. What up, Kin? I'm coming! Oh, what? Oh, I meant to teleport. Where am I? Ooh, oh, I did not mean to steal that, my bad. <laughs> did not mean to chaos. What up, bro? Ooh, I'm running out of mana. Hey, Kindred. Oh, come on, get the stun! No! Oh my gosh. Oh, that's one thing I hate. I hate it when, like, the stun does not use right away. There's like a, a 0.5 second delay when you pick the stun and then you auto attack. And that card is just not your stun. I hate that. It's so annoying. That's the one thing I freaking hate. Oh well, I wish I would have got that stun because she was taking tower hits, and that's what I was expecting. Damn it! Um, did Thresh stop? Oh, okay, that's how Thresh stopped playing. Someone's talking about toxicity here. I don't know if it's Thresh or who. Maybe maybe it's Thresh. I don't know. They're just yelling at each other. I don't know why. It's just a game, guys. Come on. Typically, we turn around games more when uh, people aren't complaining at each other. It's just, it's just, it's just a better time when people are not complaining to each other. Come on, guys. It's my lucky day. Morgana's gone. Echo's bot, so Echo's pretty much laning bot now. Kate's here. That's not good for me. Just kind of fed. What up, girl? So would they switch so that Echo can get fed now? <laughs> Wait, how did... How does Echo have two kills? What? What happened? Gosh, oh, that ping thing is so weird. I don't, I don't know how I feel about that. That new ping thing. That was a nice try. Ooh. Oh wow, that was that was a nice hit from Morgana. What? How did that hit me? That's weird. Okay. That was a nice hit from Morgana. That Morgana's pretty good, not gonna lie. Don't know if it was an accident or not. I can't go in, I'm too low. I have to go back. Um still got one potion. I have no boots. I need some boots. When did I get boots? I, I look at the I look at the boots of swiftness and it's 900 and I'm like oh I can't get boots <laughs> I actually can what what why why I don't know I don't know I don't know what's going on I don't know what's going on Echo does not have his ult but I'm not gonna really do much here I can't do much here. No matter what, they're gonna get tower. They have three people who can just trade off attacks. What up? No way! Oh my gosh, I hate Morgana so much. No way that hit me, man. How how did that pass all the minions but hit me on the edge? I don't know, man. I don't know, but I gotta go back. They got so much damage on them. Oh my gosh, man. Morgana is like a freaking pro. I hate Morgana so much. I hate Lux and Morgana. Their snares are just so annoying. 
I like playing Lux because Lux is freaking OP. Like it, it does not take any any sort of skill to play Lux, to be honest. I used to main Lux and it was mainly because I never have to go in anywhere. I could just uh kill right away. Zinzo asking if we can FF. I don't FF. I never FF. I've always turned around games before. People who say that they want to FF right away is people who have never turned around a game before because they're always just FFing. There's no reason to forfeit. Learn, learn, to, learn to turn our game around. It's easy. Trust me. I've done it many times. Um, I don't want to be out here. How's Top doing, by the way? We weren't even doing that bad, to be honest. And they have drag, so I am bouncing. I have no boots. I really, I really need my boots of swiftness. That way, I can Just escape easily, more easily. They're gonna be pushing up mid. What's down here? Oh, I thought that was a. Uh, thought that was an enemy attacking MF. Maybe I would have teleported to help her. Just uh, maybe I'm not looking hard enough, but I just never found a a use to use my alt yet. Oh, we got him! Nice. Woo! I got out of that. Was trying my hardest to dodge both of them, both him and Morgana, because I know Morgana was trying to hit me too. That was a freaking that I don't know about this Morgana. She's got to be something higher than gold for real. Because she used her uh, pool here while I was over here. That was not an accident. She knew I was going to run up there. It's Morgana. I feel like she plays a little bit too much. Of it, I think. Because I was scared. I was... If she... Does she not have Thunderlords, by the way? Where is she? She does not have Thunderlords, which is good. Because <laughs> if she had Thunderlords, it would have procced on me there and I would have died. I still don't have my call thing. I'll go. I'm gonna go top. I can't make it top. They're gonna make it first. Kendra's here. Doing it. What up, bro? They're going way too in. I'm trying to go around this thing. I don't even think that works going around it. I'm coming, guys. I'm coming. I'm coming. What up? Boosting. Let's go. She hit me. That was weird. I didn't even know she saw me. There's Echo. No! I'm not gonna be able to kill her. No, I'm not gonna be able to kill her. No! Help me, help me! Oh, we got him. Okay, cool. MF. <laughs> oh, shit. oh, shit. Oh, no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Woo! Nice. Nicely done. That was great. We just caught up. See, this is what I'm talking about. Turning this around. Let's go. Oh man, that scared me. When when Rek'Sai ulted, because I know his alt changed. I don't remember what it did. or uh, I remember what it did, but I've never seen it in action yet. Nor have I seen videos about it. But when he ult I know it goes to a champion, so I was scared when he ulted. I was like, that is coming to me. But it went to Zinzao, so I'm good. Doing it. Sorry, Zinzao, but... Me being ranged, I think that'll end the fact that I have a stun. I think... That all played out because I was able to stun Rek'Sai right there. Deal. If that was me who died, one, uh, Zinzao would have had to run backwards because I was ahead of Zinzao, so... Rek'Sai would have went in front of him. I have to stay here. I can't I can't go anywhere. Rek'Sai would have went in front of Zinzao, so Zinzao would have had to run back and then he would have obviously... Probably not been able to get away. Maybe he would have. I don't know. I'm, I'm just speculating. What is going on down here? Someone's dying. I'm here, guys. I'm here. 
Who needs a stun? Oh, this is not working out. No way. Oh my gosh. MF, your ult does not do damage. <laughs> Guys, focus the same person. Why, Thresh, why are you focusing Rek'Sai? Like, Rek'Sai is not even needed right now. It should be Kate. And MF had the right there, focusing Kate. Whew. This Kate, man. I hate, I hate Kate mains, man. I swear. Anytime you see Pulse Fire Kate, you know they're a Kate main. Damn. He just juked Teemo and got the kill. Gosh, man. It's still 18 CS I need. This is horrible. Can't believe I don't have 100 CS yet. Ooh, nice one. Oh, you should have ran away. Oh, man. That was good, though. Teemo's doing good. Teemo, you are doing great. Keep up the good work, Teemo. Give me this. So, yeah, pretty much ADTF has become, like, my second favorite champion to play. It's just so fun. Haven't really been able to show off much of what makes TF fun because I don't know this game is this game is pretty much half and half so typically it really shows when like I'm just doing really great and then it really shows how how ADTF can really turn a game around because me usually when usually after like I have a bunch of kills and I have my full build Typically, I will go in with a stun, quickly go to their back line, stun someone and quickly take them out, and then all of a sudden, like, their entire uh, team composition just collapses because I just took out their back guy. Doesn't matter how the rest of my team is going. Ooh, she, she shot that diagonally. I should have went the other way. What up, girl? I'm afraid of Morgana being here by herself because that... It's got to mean that there's someone else here. She can also stop my stuns, which is... Teemo's just hiding there. Oh, no, Teemo! You're crazy, Teemo. Oh, Teemo's doing a lot of damage, though. I'm gonna help out Teemo. Yeah, let me get stunned. Ah, oh, man. Oh, well. I'm coming, Teemo. Nice one, Teemo. That was a nice heal. And Rek'Sai is staying? Why? I shouldn't be focusing Rek'Sai, but... And I didn't even hit, uh... I didn't even hit Kindred, which I probably should've with my Q. So that way I can get the assist. Gotta go back mid now. So much running for TF. I have, have not used my ult yet. I don't even think I've used my ult yet. Charmed, I'm sure. This is like probably the first time I've never used my ult in the game. Not the first time. Usually when usually when my team is losing early, I usually never use my ult because there's just never a time to. There is a point where a lot of times... Woo! There's a point where a lot of times when I use my ult, I'm like the only person going in, especially bot lane. Every time I say I'm coming bot and then I use my ult, my... When my team is usually losing, my team's usually at the tower and they just don't come out. They just don't want to. It was a good try. Probably should have done that first, Thresh, instead of waiting for us to go in, because that's what made her back off in the first place. A little lesson of stealth. If they see us coming in, of course she's gonna run away. You cray cray! Zinzao, you cray cray. Oh. Oh, she flashed. Maybe I should mark that. Uh, I'm good. Kindred's here. I know Kindred got changed too. I have no idea what it's about. It's like something about her attack speed or something. And I, I know it's her passive that changed. Oh. Now we have to worry about Kate and her. Her Guardian's Angel. I'm so surprised they changed Guardian's Angel to be more AD. That's weird. Whew! Zinzao, you're crazy! To be honest, we should be focusing Kate right now. Woo! Nice one. Give me that health. 
All right, doing great so far. Oh, oh, I did not even see him. <laughs> I did not know that was Echo. My bad. I did not know that was their Echo. I thought it was someone on our team. It was so weird because like no one was attacking, so I didn't even I didn't even notice. Oh whale. Um, but yeah, we definitely gotta focus Kate. Definitely gotta focus Kate in uh, fights. That is definitely who I'm going to be stunning. She is the most fed right now. Oh wait, she is not. Echo is what? That's crazy. What? I thought I thought Kate was the most fed. I gotta pay attention more. Cray cray. Let's go. Oh, I see. I don't know. Did I get the bonus gold or do I need one more minion? I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna sell it just in case. How much do I get for selling? 180. I don't know. D what? <laughs> I wish it was a more uh, it was more visible. I think if I need one more minion, it'll have a one next to it. That's what I'm thinking. Wish it would show differently. Like I don't know, grayed out or something. Maybe I don't know. Give it like a permanent cooldown. Screw your, screw your attack, dog. When you're stunned, you get to attack me. That's so dumb. That is so dumb. When she's stunned, she still gets to hit me. That is dumb. Their entire team pretty much counters me. We got Morgana with her spell shield. Uh, her with the fact that it doesn't even matter if she's stunned. She can still hit me. Stuns all our snares all around from Morgana. Except I've not seen her ult yet, so... Oh man, this is not going good, but we're turning it, we are, we have turned it around a little bit so far, which is good, especially with Timo. Timo and Xin Zhao, Xin Zhao has been going in, and MF's alts are starting to do damage too, so, everyone's turning around but me, I'm like the one who's just feeding, I'm the feeder. Oh, uh, I could have, I could have went down there a lot. Got you! Oh, I did not mean to steal it again. <laughs> Most of my kills were steals and I feel bad for it. Ah, oh, see? Ah, oh, the delay! I hate it! I still got my stun! The delay is so annoying. I hate him. We got him. That's all I wanted. I want the assist. Give me the assist, I'll be good. I don't need the kills. You guys can, you guys can carry me. I've done nothing good this entire game. Go. Alright, dragon's up. I'm gonna go war dragon. If you guys wanna come and get dragon's fine. But I'm gonna just ward it. Do 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 do. Always on the run. And attack! Attack dragon! Thresh is coming down. Let's go get dragon thresh. Thresh! 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 Where are you going, Thresh? Can I still get it? I think I can still get it. As long as no one comes here, I can probably still get it. Thresh is just soloing that right now. You go, Thresh! You go! Oh, one more hit. Let's do this! Thunder, so she can't ult. No! No! One more. Ah, oh, and she can still hit me. Oh my gosh. One more hit needed. That is so dumb. She probably had like one health left. I hate it when that happens with TF, man. They just, they're just so low at the end. It's the same with minions. You hit a minion and they just have like that one HP left. It's so annoying. It's because I'm behind. Being behind just it messes up with your damage. I'm so not used to it. Especially after you play Varus and then you just got so much damage right off the bat. Mainly auto attack damage. I don't realize it. I could be queuing a bunch more too, but I feel like the Q... The Q interrupts my auto attacks and makes it so I don't auto attack as fast. So, And considering it only does 69 damage because I'm 80, it's, to me it's just better to auto attack. 
Now if it was if it did not interrupt my auto text and it was like instant, I'd always be queuing. What champ? I know there's a champ that does stuff like that. I mean, I know kin like for instance, Kindred is best to jump all around because it does not interrupt anything, and your jump does that does like damage to like multiple enemies and stuff. So really good to do. They're coming up around here. Woo! Oh snap! Let's go. I'm coming in. No one's here. They're all dead. <laughs> I just I just came up for cleanup. My my kills right now are a lie. I should have like I think one kill. The rest were straight up chaoses, which is sad. Get him! Yeah. Now that I think I feel like I deserve because I was I was on him the whole entire time and I stunned him, so I feel like I deserve that. I'm two and five right now. Alright guys, we're keeping track. Let me get that. Oh, I wanted that. Woo. Also another thing I love about uh being ADTF is uh rage rage cannon. Cannon rage. Whatever it's called. Um, just making it so I can, s my stun will go further is awesome. Look at this, turning around this game. This is what I'm talking about, guys. Oh, another, another person that was just under being dead. It's always because, it's because I don't have 100% crit, that's why. So when it doesn't crit, it just throws me off. I need my 100% crit. Zen, you're going down. <laughs> One thing that really helps with Kindred's ult is when you're low, when Kindred is low, but then uh, the other person is high, so you can just keep getting their health really low. Um, I can't, I need an 800. I was about to type it. That's how used I was to typing, and it just takes a bit longer. Oh my gosh, Timo! Timo, do not stand in his ult. Come on. I'm always trying to avoid Echo's ult. That standing as his ult is like a double whammy because not only does he get healed and can escape, but it also does a ton of damage. You guys already know this. I'm just I'm just saying what comes to my mind. Kindred, ah, can I go I can Cause she, I know she doesn't have her ult. Actually, I'm going to stay right here because I think she's coming up. Is she coming? Okay, never mind. I'm going up. I'm, I'm too far behind. Oh, she went. She went through the jungle. Anyone want to go in? Anyone want to go? Yeah, let's go. Get her. Yeah. Nice one. Go, go, go. Support TF found the way. Can you slow her? Yeah, nice one. Oh no. She flashed. When in doubt, get the mana card. Oh man. I'm, I'm, I'm sad. I'm very sad right now. Lol. Oh man. I was coming in for that. Oh, I didn't even see Echo. I could have used a stun card on him. Give me that. Ah, oh, I wanted that. Give me the in him. Yeah, my team's just killing everyone without me, so I'm I'm gonna just I'm gonna just let them do them. <laughs> my team don't need me. They only need me to not FF. MF, you're crazy. You're crazy, MF. MF, you're crazy. What are you doing? Nice, nice, nice and... Woo! Get him! Um, looks like we're going to get drag. Inferno is always good to get. Probably my first, my 
favorite dragon to get, and second would be the cloud. Apparently, a lot of people hate cloud dragon, but I, I love it. I, especially for uh, Varus, because you know, just having that extra movement speed is awesome. And I'm going to get my full crit, so I can not have to worry about not critting. That is annoying. Sure, Ooh. I'm sure. Can't really get anything else. Actually, oh, I could have. I think I could have upgraded that. Oh well. Too far away now. Guys, be careful. They don't need me. Whatever. Do it. Do you? You guys do you. I, I I'd like to think that my stuns helped turn the game around, but then again, I don't. I don't want to take credit because I feel like my team. It was all my team. Just the luck of the draw. I mean, there are times when I for sure know that I'm the reason that the game turned around. But this is not one of them because I was like 3 and 5. Get her, get her before she ults. Yeah. I don't even know if she had her ult. Woo. Let's get this. Oh, MF's already there. She's already like on it. Winning. It was a good game. We turned it around. It was like so. I've I've recorded a game where they turned it, where the enemy turned it around, where we just uh, flat out won, and then where we turned it around. Actually, the game's not over yet. They can still win. Stun, stun, dance. Ah, oh, I didn't dance. Stun. Oh well. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, so yeah, I've got I've got. In the three games that I've got recorded, I've got uh, one where the enemy actually ended up turning it around while I was actually talking about in that video how the enemy could turn it around because we were uh, winning. And then I got this one, or I got the last one, which was uh, AP Vars again. And that one we just flat out won. And then this one where we actually turned it around. So, or my team, not me. I didn't do anything. I did jack shit. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys just, you know, just stay awesome, guys. You guys you guys are amazing. And any any of you who watch my videos, I mean, I I am I don't give good commentary. I'm just <laughs> I'm just here not giving good commentary. It's just it's just talking about the game. Like I'm not even talking about anything really important it, except the game's kind of the only important thing, I guess. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Stay awesome, guys.